Today we begin our sciatica series with an exercise called knee to opposite shoulder. Lie on your back with your legs extended and your feet pointing upwards, like so. Now gently bend your right leg and clasp your hands around the knee. Gently pull your right leg across the body towards your left shoulder and hold this position for 30 seconds when you can feel a stretch. A lot about sciatica is releasing the muscles and the joints from around the nerves, allowing you to enable flexibility. This exercise is also useful if you've got arthritis of the hip, of the spine, or if you just want to increase the mobility around the hips. After 30 seconds have passed, gently return your knee to the starting position, and repeat on the opposite leg. So with the sciatica series, all these exercises, bar one, are basically stretching exercises because it's all about releasing the tension around the nerves as sciatica is where the nerves get trapped behind the spine and in the hips causing the pains down your lower back and your legs. After 30 seconds have passed, again return to the starting position and if you can, stand up and or continue the next exercise. Most of these are going to be based around laying on the floor or being in a chair. So if you want to do this as part of a routine, it's best that you do all the videos together. That has been how to do a chest to knee. No, it hasn't. It's been how to do a knee to opposite shoulder. The next one's called the chest to knee.